what is going on everybody boy do i have a treat for you today i'm going over arc invest space etf ticker symbol arc x it's going live march 29 a couple of days from now and i got my hand on a full detailed report about nine stocks that could go into the arc x etf fund i'm gonna share a couple of those picks and i'm gonna leave a link in the description below so you can grab a copy of the full list it's gonna be very very good video if you find it valuable leave a like let's get started with arc invest space etf arc x let's go my friend at red cliff research right here again link in the description below did a very detailed research about the stocks that could go into arc etf space x and before they even do that they tell you a little bit about why they think space is gonna be very very massive opportunity in the future and i tend to agree and as always you need to pick the right stocks in the space in order to go to the moon and caddy want to send us to the moon and what do they have to say about that check it out guys check it out so they go on and saying that apollo 11 astronaut first landed on the moon they captured the eyes of the world and ever since then there wasn't a lot of like hype but this is all gonna change look at this they wrote it right here there's some pictures and uh wrote right here look at this guys nasa has confirmed this is very important nasa has confirmed to sending humans back to moon in 2024 to set up a permanent present at the lunar uh, south pole and elon musk again another one very important event uh, spacex has planned to put boots on march by 2030 and probably pay some dogecoin to live there but that's a different story with this new achievement only a few short years away level of excitement for space that was alive and well in the late 60s is about to come back stronger than ever than ever that means super hype and you need to be in before it happens scroll a little bit uh, down this report will certainly give you an edge always look for an edge guys for how to stay ahead of that curve we are mainly focused on a much more immediate avenue of profit getting one step ahead of the upcoming arc space exploration etf which will be going public on march 29 under the ticker symbol arc x some people ask them shouldn't i just buy arc x on launch day and let the uh, genius caddy would carry me to guaranteed riches no let me tell you why they don't think so and why they think that you can outperform the etf by picking single stocks that could go into the etf that are in the space uh, area we have reason to believe that the arc x fund is being uh, spearheaded by sam curious that's the analyst long time arc analyst with a limited background in aerospace industry talk about more in on sam in this report is an important factor so if arc x isn't being run by a double phd rocket science or even someone with an aerospace degree there's no good reason to doubt your personal ability to outperform arc x this report will give you the tools necessary to outperform arc space etf we'll start by helping you get into uh, quality space stocks now Anticipation of Caddy Wood endorsement sending these equities through the stratosphere or basically to the moon. So to make it in simple words, they're saying that the analyst Sam will be in charge of Arc X, but he's no space person, he's not astronaut, he, he doesn't have the information or the knowledge to make the great picks. That the, and that's why if you pick uh, space stocks either from this uh, your own research or, for, or from this. Uh, 18 pages long research you could have the potential to out, out, outperform the arc x etf in the long run and they also said if you pick those stocks and then caddy pick those stocks most likely they will be there will be hyped and they will give you even more return if you buy them before caddy buys them basically that that's always a great deal if you buy a stock and then a, a week or two after that caddy says hey we bought that stock that's amazing stuff let's keep going now they keep on saying after combining over 40 space stocks for the best one we have produced reports on our top nine 
Okay, so they went over 40 space stocks that are trading in the Nasdaq in the stock market as a whole today. And from those 40 space stock, they picked nine. And they keep on saying that most ARK funds have between 30 to 50 holdings. So we certainly could have a cast a much larger net, but we decided that nine was the perfect balance. This stock we picked were hand selected for their high likelihood of making it to the fine, combined with the relatively small market cap, making them susceptible to very large upward swing. And this is what we want. We want 10x, 100x, etc. We want to go to the moon and moon stocks are the way to go with this space ETF that's coming up in about a week. These are the key areas that will be in the arc space etf reusable rockets orbital aerospace suborbital aerospace aerial drones 3d printing and enabling technology investment focus subcategories that will be in the arc x below is a list of stock with notable growth potential that we thought deserve a place in this report nine of them are the stocks we will be front running arc x with but there are several others that exhibit opportunities or profit beyond near term. That being said, guys, let me give you two or three picks from this report. Pick number one, and I did a video about them. I will link this in the, in the, the video description as well. Rocket Lab, uh, ticker symbol VACQ, around 12 bucks today. This is a spark in the reusable rocket space. I have a market cap of $4 billion after uh, the merger will complete and they will trade under the ticker symbol RKLB. Go on and saying institution have about 92% ownership in the reusable rocket subcategory Red Cliff Research. This is where the report is. They designated as the Arc X front run and long term hold with a price target five years from now of 90 bucks. That's about 9x your money if everything goes according to the plan. And they, they go on and talk all about this. And let me show you a very cool thing. What they do, Rocket Lab, they are doing this. This is insane. They are 3D printing an entire rocket engine from start to finish. Let me repeat this. Uh, rocket Lab 3D print an entire rocket engine from start to finish this allows them to print one print not make print one engine every 24 hours with extreme uh, precision and reliability they, they go on to say that rocket lab will uh, compete with spacex falcon 9 of elon musk uh, that's pretty awesome in my opinion even elon musk uh, tweeted about that so you can guys can go ahead and read this report in the description as well price target of uh, 90 bucks and they also put us here uh, because again and i agree with that i have no idea about space anything about space it's just like buying uh, in my opinion buying crypto 2016 would you buy a uh, bitcoin in 2016 or ethereum do you even know what it was five years ago probably not and they put this right here early adapter stage if you buy now a uh, rocket lab at like 12 bucks most likely four or five years from now you will be here just like you bought uh, bitcoin as an early adapter in 2016 five years later you are a very very happy camper so this is what they think they didn't say buy here uh, when the vision visionary uh, and and the, basically the people that invested in Rocket Lab actually invested private company, but they went public like two weeks ago, and this is a great time to invest a small amount of your portfolio, not the financial advice, and then the parabolic growth. Maybe when people start talking about uh, going to the moon, just like crypto, four or five years later, it's not gonna happen next week, uh, basically, and then up 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 until it becomes a very solid mature company and by that time if you invested here uh, just like bitcoin you are a very happy person right now let's keep going with pick number two. Second pick out of the nine in this list is maxar technology ticker symbol maxr 3 billion market cap 76 percent institution or ownership subcategory is orbital aerospace 
and I think it will go to Arc X uh, front run, meaning buying now before the launch and also long term hold. A price target of about 130 bucks. They traded almost 40, 30 something now, so that's about on a four, four, five x from here, give or take. And I'm talking about this one with the cost of orbital launches falling. Every company seems to want their very own satellite consultation. This makes sense. As satellite consultations are the phenomenal source for passive income for the companies who owns them. I have no idea, but I need to get into this business of passive income from uh, satellites into space. Comment below, how do I do that uh, so we can all go to the moon? Uh, and, and leave a comment. If you think it's funny, leave a comment as well. What do these companies do uh, when they need their satellite built? They turn to Maxar Technology. The expert in the satellite world, companies like Maxar are the direct beneficiary of reusable rocket technology as reduced the, the, the launch cost, increase their profit margin and drive up demand for their service. And let me show you something very important about these guys. Uh, the, the, they have a NASA contract, okay? They have a NASA contract to build the robotic sampling arm that will be going to the moon in 2024 alongside the first astronauts of the Artemis program. There are a few small space themed ETF already in existence, okay? There are, I think there are two or three ETF about space. Max R is the top holding, so most likely Caddy will invest in this. But this is like a big, uh, like a solid company to invest. Company model is improving life on Earth from space. It's quite difficult to imagine them not going into Arc X. That's what I think as well. Let me repeat this sentence again. They have a NASA contract. You guys, the Palantir Moon guys, you know how much you love government contracts. So uh, this company has NASA contract to build the robotic sampling arm. Is this why really like a robot arm that goes to the moon? Will be going to the moon in 2024 alongside the first astronauts Artemis program. Again, I'm not a space person. I'm a numbers person. This industry haven't even started haven't even started if you buy now again you just like buying crypto five years ago you don't know where it's going it's not gonna go to the moon uh now but it could go to the moon literally uh <laughs> three years from 2024 and most likely if you invest now your earnings will see massive massive gain just my opinion not a financial advice now this report goes on and gives you nine super solid picks again they went over 40 space related stocks that are already publicly trading and they picked nine. They also give you stocks that will not be in this list. I'm going to give you a hint. Boeing is not in that list. Boeing is not going to be in the space. It, it could be, but they're not going to invest in uh, Boeing. You could invest in Boeing. It's up to you. I'm going to do a video about Boeing in the next couple of days. But if you want to have an edge and you want to pick the stocks that will be or could top perform ARK X ETF because they're saying that the analyst is not like a, a super space uh, expert basically and they have more knowledge than him. They give you great picks. You guys can pick up the report in the description below. Highly advise you do so. You support this great team of Red Cliff Research and you also support uh, me and this channel but it's pretty cheap and pretty massive uh, for the amount that you pay to get nine space picks. As always guys if I bring you any sort of value just a hinge of value subscribe to my channel and hit the bell and if you want to go to the moon literally go to the moon <laughs> grab, grab a copy of this uh, very detailed very good report solid picks i like it i'm gonna pick uh, at least one if not more stocks into my long-term portfolio i don't care if it does uh 50 profit in a week or two after uh keddy lunch basically 
but go do, do what you want to do i'm very bullish on the space industry as a whole very thankful for red cliff research uh, resources for get, making this research report uh, to expand my knowledge always learn more you can't learn enough subscribe like hit all that bell all that good stuff thank you guys and i will see you in the next video